friends, good morning, good evening, wherever you are in the world. My name is Sandra and I make videos all about cybersecurity, careers and technology, as well as work vlogs. So today won't be a typical work vlog just because, first of all, it's already in the afternoon. I already went through basically half my work day for today. But I did just want to start this work vlog just because I kind of felt like vlogging today. I don't know. I think it's because this whole week I have been basically working on this one Python script and I recently started using Selenium. I don't know if you guys are familiar, but it is kind of like a it's kind of like a browser automation testing tool that different testing teams use. But basically using Selenium with Python, I can make a script that clicks on buttons on a website and enters text. So that is kind of what I'm looking for and that's what Selenium is really useful for. Even if you are not a tester, I would definitely recommend looking into that. So basically I am playing around with it right now. Uh, I spent basically the whole day kind of troubleshooting. In my previous vlog, I did say that I was a cybersecurity engineer. So because I was in a rotation program, um, the team that I joined, I don't necessarily have a title that matches exactly what I do on a day to day. And I feel like you guys will find that in larger corporations, especially your specific day to day responsibilities don't necessarily match with the title that you might have. Because in my rotational program, I was a developer, I was a cybersecurity analyst, I was a web app pen tester, and now my current role, I am not really any of those things. And I really focus more on automation, um, cybersecurity engineering stuff, or maybe into the DevOps side. And this afternoon, I don't have too much, I just have one more call at four o'clock, I believe. And the rest of the time, I'm basically working on this Python script. Another update is that I do have an official date to going back to the office. So I am officially going back to the office. I believe I will not be working hybrid and I will be working five days out of the office. So when I do go back, it'll be full time in the office. So I do want to kind of give you guys a heads up on that because I'm not sure how I will do these vlogs if that is the case because I don't want to you know, like vlog in my office just in case there is some kind of rule that doesn't allow me to do things like that, which I can understand, of course. So just wanted to give you guys a heads up in case my future work vlogs do not look the same. I mean, obviously I still want to show you guys my work life and do these vlogs because I enjoy them. And I think you guys enjoy them too. Let me know in the comments below. Or if you have any video suggestions that you think I could replace these vlogs with, or maybe half of these vlogs, so I'll do less vlogs and more informational content instead which of course I am all for, but I do think seeing the day-to-day -day of what someone works on is also really helpful for when you actually see what someone is doing, you know, as a cybersecurity analyst or a cybersecurity engineer. People will tell you high level what they do, but you don't actually see it on a day-to-day -day unless you're, you know, watching someone's actual vlog throughout their workday. But yeah, I'm thinking eventually I'll do some kind of work week in my life. So I'll film a little bit each day, but it won't, it probably won't be in the office and it'll probably just be going to work talking about what i did that day for work uh different problems i ran into but it won't be as you know eating breakfast sitting at my desk the things i basically film in my work from home vlogs i'm gonna spice it up a little bit i think it will still be interesting um just because you get to see a bit more high level and another thing is that i haven't worn this jumper or like this sweater since last winter so that's how i know time is flying by and it is november i am Honestly, I might as well just say it's almost December because it is and that really blows my mind. I don't know. Um, this year has been flying by and I think I read a quote somewhere that said, the days are slow, but the weeks, the months, the years are fast and they fly by. So that is literally how I feel because throughout my day, I feel like time is moving so slowly, but before I know it, the week's already over, you know? So that's kind of how I've been feeling. This week has been a bit slower compared to other weeks though, because it's just been a lot going on honestly a lot more waiting on things and talking to people and requesting access to things i have rambled on for 15 minutes i hopefully am going to be able to cut this down to a much shorter amount of time when i post this but yeah i'm going to go back to work and i will talk to you guys in a little bit all right guys quick snack this is called dragon fruit i don't know if it's a well-known fruit but it's so good especially the yellow ones i can't even explain the taste if you haven't had it before it kind of tastes like a kiwi without any of the sour so like a guaranteed sweet kiwi. I think you can get these at most Asian supermarkets. You can probably get this at Whole Foods too at this point, I think. Okay, another video idea I've been thinking about is maybe some kind of work desk tour or like at home work setup, I don't know. Let me know if you guys are interested in that because once we move, I won't be working from home anymore. So I figured I might as well to commemorate the two years of us working virtually. I would love to film a video like that. So let me know in the comments below if that's something you guys are interested in. I can definitely film something a bit more, 
I don't know. I, I do want to be more creative with some of the videos I post on this channel. So if I am making something a bit more cinematic in terms of our desk setup and of course cleaning up a little bit because this area is just such a mess and <laughs> I obviously don't want to show it to you guys right now as it is. When I do get around to filming it, I do want it to look more aesthetically pleasing, more cinematic than my normal everyday, you know, casual vlogs. Yeah, let me know. I just sent out a few uh, requests to some teams I'm working with and I finally got something approved, so that is exciting. Uh, looking at a few things on my team's inbox that came in, so I am still kind of working on different requests that come in from my team, even though a lot of my time is also spent on Python and scripting. So there's the messiest corner of my table that I usually don't show you guys, but here it is. But I did want to show you my plant. But like I said earlier, these are all going to be cleaned up a little bit before I show you my work setup. But I do have this plant for my cousin that he gave me as a wee little two-leafer. So this is a Monstera Adansoni, something like that. But after I got it, it basically just started yellowing and all the leaves had had yellow since I got it. So I know it's something I'm doing wrong, but yeah, since then I've had these two leaves that have not had much yellow, so that's exciting. This is the kind of stuff when you're living at home and this is what gets you excited. All right, we're gonna go work out for a little bit. I don't know if I told you guys on this channel, but I officially broke my personal record of squatting my body weight, which is about 100. I started working out in May of 2021 so now it's about November. It took six months to get here. I started out with the bar being too heavy for me and now I can use it as a warm up, you know? So it's crazy. Hope that inspires you guys a little bit. Yeah, we're just gonna work out. I'm rambling, so talk to you guys in a bit. We got a pair of shoes for Luca. Pretty good. Are these NMDs or these are old shoes? Pretty good. Cat carriers, that's like a big shoe. I think they can just fit in there. <laughs> well, making the trip. All right, guys. Who wants some good stuff? I'm the food guy. That's the year job, girl. <laughs> Bella, Belle, Koji. All right guys, so I don't know if you guys know, but I don't think I mentioned it before on this channel, but our cats have ear infections and they gave us these ear drops. Uh, you have to flush their ears with them. So obviously cats are very not into that. And I am the one who does all of this ear dropping. I like cut their claws. I also like get rid of their uh, eye boogers. And he is the one who feeds them the good food. So, I'm just like the mom that no one likes. Look at this. Look at this. Fake. But yeah, I think most of their ears are healing though. One of them had it really bad. Um, even now when I clean her ears and flush them, I can see like the brown stuff that comes out. Originally thought they were ear mites, but they were ear infections, which this thumbs up looks really bad, but honestly it's better than ear mites. But the ear infections, you just need to use this flush and then every other day for two weeks and then one week as prevention. They're literally starving themselves for this type of treat. They're so cute. Guys, they look like we never feed them, right? But we do. There's always food. It's just that they really prefer wet food. So I feel like they just starve themselves to yep. wait for wet okay. food. But they can't always eat wet food because it gives them diarrhea. But obviously they don't know that, so. I'm mixing some dry food with it. Okay, that's good. Now that you've been eating the dry food, you and Belle clean house. Yeah, I guess they really like this gravy. The last gravy we got wasn't good. Yeah, Thank that you. has been our lives for the last few weeks. Is Koji actually Some not of these hungry? cats are really picky eaters. Or should I say something? To either just eat it initially a little bit. Hi guys, it has been such a weird day. I did not expect to suddenly vlog, <laughs> but here we are. But yeah, my SD card is actually full right now, so. OOTD. They're saying this for kids. That's part of the fun. 
The flat thing. Cause. Where? His mustache, he used to walk. Okay, you see that one lady? Yeah. But you can tell a bridge. It's a long cross. Is that cross? Yeah. yeah. Hey, there's a crack on this window. Hey, are we ready? Come on. You don't look like a shark. Oh, he's so Hi. Hi. Oh, he's so cute. Wait, why are they upside down? Or I'm just getting it wrong. Like, the poor thing. That's fucking hurt. Oh, they're really long. Wow. Yeah. That's one jellyfish. So pretty and like translucent and neon. Alright, guys, I think I'm gonna close out the vlog here. Um, my SD card is about to be full. Probably in the next two minutes. I think I said I have two minutes left. So I'm gonna close out really quickly. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe and turn on post notifications. Let me know what videos you guys want to see from me. Future vlogs, uh, topics, coding, cybersecurity, anything. And if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe and turn on post notifications. I post videos every Wednesday at 2 p.m. and Sundays at 12 p.m. And hopefully I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.